I like that from even from this far away, the first thing you see is the dodo. You don't even see the base. You can see the giant hole that I've dug for the basement. Good day, friends. Welcome back to Pixar. Or should I do this one? I like this one as well. Hands up. Hmm. Good day friends, welcome back to Pixar and I've got some bad news and some good news. I think I'm going to start with the bad news. Just let's just get that over with and that is that I was just at the T-Rex place. I was just at my T-Rex trap and a T-Rex walked in so I almost had a T-Rex. Now as soon as he walked in I paused the game and I thought I have to record this. I have to record this but then something came up. I had to go so I thought you know what when I'll come back I will record taming the T-Rex. But there's one big mistake that I made and that is that everything that isn't already tamed disappears when you log out. So the T-Rex was just gone when I got back into the game and that's just so sad. That's just so sad. But let's move on because there's good news as well. There's a lot of really good news as well. First off, uh, you guys give some suggestions for my Argentavis and it's not this one. Because when I was just at the T-Rex place, an Argentavis did also uh, go into the cave. So now I have a second Argentavis. Tavis and it's a boy so now we have a girl and a boy thank you guys for the suggestions for the name uh, I asked if you guys knew a name for this Argentavis and you guys gave so many names I cannot choose but I think I will go with Flappy I like Flappy so thank you for the name uh, I will call this one Flappy now someone also said Robbie and then I said what but it's a girl we cannot name a, 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 a Robbie is more like a boy's name but now I have a boy so you know what I will, I will call this one Robbie. So there we go. Thank you for the name suggestions. If you have any more, let me know. Uh, what else did I want to talk about? Okay, so now for the first really good news. What makes me really happy is I want to give a very big shout out to someone named Spaced Panna. She was very patient to explain to me how to change the spoiling timer. Check it out. Okay, uh, let's see. A berry. When does it spoil? In two hours. Usually it spoils in just a few minutes. So thank you so much to Spaced Panda. She explained to me how to change the timer. You can make it really long. I'm not sure if you can turn it off forever. But now when I have meat or something. Wait, let me check your inventory. No, no, I meant to check your... No. <laughs> show, me, show me the meat. Show it. The meat expires in four hours. Almost five hours does it take to expire. Now that's a long time. So thank you so much to Space Panda. Everyone go to her channel if you want to see some really good Pixar videos. And tell her Lego Story says thank you. Now for the second good news. Uh, is something that I'm really happy about. But it's really hard to explain. Basically for a while I've, I've, I didn't know what to do with the ground floor of my base. And I've decided to make it bigger. So that's why I drew this big circle i've drawn like this big circle and i just know what i'm gonna do now i have the inspiration that i've been waiting for for so long uh i just didn't know what to do and finally last night actually in the middle of the night because i couldn't sleep it was really warm all of a sudden i could see it in my head i could see exactly how i wanted to build it and it's going to take very long it's going to take many episodes but it's going to be worth it is that a firefly I really need fireflies i really you know, for the firefly lamps from last episode, yeah, I'm going to need, as, and I'm going to need to capture every firefly that I can. Where, did, where are you? Come here, come here, you. There we go. Anyway, yeah, I wish I could show you guys what I'm seeing in my head, but I can picture what the base is going to look like, and it is amazing. And now for the third big news, and you've probably already seen it in the title and the thumbnail of the video, the dodo statue is finally done. Uh, version 1.0, it is absolutely huge. I thought my tower was pretty big. Oh my god, look at this. Look at how big it is. It is absolutely... My tower is 50 by 50 blocks. It's a circle of 50 by 50 blocks. That's how big my tower is. And the dodo is longer than that. The dodo is... I can... I can if I go on the head of the dodo, I'm this small. I'm the, can you can you actually land? You can... You can yeah, really? Okay. All right, then. Uh, but seriously, look at how small I am. What? Yeah, as I just said last night, I just really couldn't sleep. Like, where I live, I don't know about you guys, but where I live, it's really warm. I just couldn't sleep because it was just too warm. 
And so I just stayed up and decided, you know what, I'm going to make some progress on the dodo. So yeah, I didn't expect to actually complete it, but version 1.0 is done. Uh, version 2.0 is going to be when I actually paint it. Uh, it's going to, of course, have the real dodo colors, so it's going to be a huge dodo statue, and every dodo for miles around will see the statue, and they will come to the dodo sanctuary where they can be safe. So yeah, that's a lot of really good news, I think. Yeah, I didn't get a T-Rex, but the good news is better than the bad news is bad, I think. I didn't get a T-Rex, but the st statue is do done. It took me like five or six hours to build. I don't know, it took me very long to build, but I'm so happy that it's done and that my food won't spoil anymore. And also, oh, there was one thing that I forgot to show in the last episode. Um, if you guys have seen the last episode, I tried a lot of random things. There was one thing that I really wanted to try and I completely forgot, so I made it and it is... Check it out, you guys. It's awesome. It's an elevator. You can actually have an elevator in Pixar. I didn't know this. It is so cool. You just go like this and then you go, well, up. I don't need to go up. Uh, let's actually go all the way down to the bottom. It's very slow, so if I want to go fast, it's still better to uh, use the stairs. So I'm going to keep the stairs around it. Uh, but I think it looks pretty cool. I think it's so it's it's just fun. It's just fun. Look, I can AFK. I can do whatever I want. Welcome to the bottom floor. <laughs> this is so cool. I love it. I love it. I love it. I still use the stairs half of the time. Depend. It really depends if I'm in a hurry. Okay. So now the reason why I went here is because when I was flying around earlier, I saw something. And it might be nothing. I'm going to say that. I'm going to be honest. I think maybe it's nothing. Maybe it's something. I think it might be something. Basically what I saw. <laughs> you're probably wondering. Okay, so what did you actually see? Um, what I saw was in a cave. I saw something that looked like a wall. Now I really want to see. I want to mine through that wall. Or find a door. And see what it is. It's like It, it might be like some kind of underground room. Underground like, what if it's if there's an entire building, like, underground, like some kind of dungeon? That would be so cool, but maybe it's nothing, because I really only saw a very small part of, like, a purple wall. Anyway, I'm going to prepare for battle, and I'm going to check it out and see if it's really worth exploring. Okay, let's see if I can actually find this wall. I'm not sure, it was somewhere around... Was it here? I think it was... Maybe it was... Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Okay, so I, as I said, it might be absolutely nothing. Maybe it is nothing. I really don't know. I really don't know. What if it's nothing? That's going to be so awkward if it's nothing. Okay, but it's some kind of purple. Oh, it's some kind of rock. Oh, it's not a wall. Are you serious? Oh, man, I was preparing for battle. I genuinely thought it was like a wall to some kind of, like, underground dungeon thing. What is this coral? It is coral rock. I don't know. I'm getting it. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it does. This building material is found in shallow seas. Yes, we are not in a sea right now. The game, you are confused. Oh, man. I really thought that something... <laughs> I really thought it was like some kind of building. I really thought I had found something. Uh, it's a good thing I told you guys that it might have been nothing. Or you might have gotten as excited as I was. <laughs> Okay, you know what? I'm going to see if I can find some iron in here or if I can find one of those moles. I really need one of those mole claws so I can make a mole claw pickaxe because I think that's one of the best pickaxes. <gasps> There's one right there. There's one right there. Kill it. Kill it. Give me your mole claws, please. Does it even drop the mole claw if you kill it with the bird? I'm not sure. I've already killed like five before. I cannot get them. Okay, let's kill a cat. I don't know why. I'm just I'm just I'm just mean at this point. I'm just a bully. Rah! I love that they have a little shark tail going on. That's so cool. <gasps> There's two of them. There's two of them right here. There's two of them. Come on. Did I kill any of them? No, I didn't kill them yet. I killed something else. Come on. Come on, please give me this mole claw. I really need the pickaxe. No! Okay, where did the other one go? There was another one. What? I cannot get it. I cannot... Wait, let me get off. Let me check your inventory. What, do you have a mole claw? No. 
How do you get the mole claw from the claw mole? I don't actually wait 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 let me seriously Oh my god 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 Yes 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 you guys Okay to make a mole pickaxe you need to make something else first wait what do you meet need to make first a magic workbench Okay, well, let's learn a magic workbench. Okay, I'm going to have to make a magic workbench, which takes... Which requires things from the magic forest. I'm in a magic forest now, so I might as well try to collect it, but I'm, I never feel safe here. I never feel safe here. This is one of the biomes that I have not really fully explored yet. Okay, can I collect things as the bird? No, I was afraid of that. I was afraid of that. I don't think I can. Oh man, you guys, I'm going to need magic versions of everything. Do I need magic berries? I don't know. Do I need magic grass? I guess I do. Magic fiber. Okay. I don't know. I'm just going to collect a lot and hope I don't get killed. Oh god. Oh god. I'm getting killed. I'm getting killed already. I'm getting attacked. I'm getting attacked already by a spider. Wait, I think my thing can actually get a spider. Let's try that out. I can. Ha! Ah! Ah! Ha! Who's tough now? Who's tough now? Urgh! Kill it in the air. Kill it. It's actually pretty strong. If I want to tame something that can be grabbed by my bird, then it will be really easy. All I have to do is make a cage near my base. Oh, I got a lot of, like, magical stones. Nice. Okay, I'm going to have to continue collecting more stuff because I need a lot to make a magic workbench. Two hours later. Okay, that's enough. That's enough, you guys. Whoa, 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 whoa. T-Rex right here. Of course, it's here. And not when I needed you back at my T-Rex trap. So I hope you guys don't mind that I'm not doing that quest. Because I cannot find any iron right now. But I'm really excited. Because I'm going to start my magic room. I'm going to... I really want to try out that portal. There's a portal. And if you go through it, you go into like a dinosaur museum. That shows all the creatures that you've met. And it shows like information about all the creatures and the blocks. And I really want to see that. I really... Actually, I kind of wanted to do that from day one. But I didn't ev even know how it worked or what it was. But apparently all you need is like 10 wood and you can make a portal and you can go there So that would be perfect in my magic room as well I like that from even from this far away the first thing you see is the dodo You don't even see the base you can see the giant hole that I've dug for the basement uh, You don't see anything all it shows is the dodo and for some reason the rock turns brown like as if it's dirt But it's still rock so I don't know why it looks like dirt wait wait for it there we go, it's rock. <laughs> that is so weird, I don't know why it turns into dirt. Okay, let's call an elevator. I'm just going to call both of them. Let's see which one is closer. That's usually how I do it, kind of like in a, with a real elevator. I just call both of them and see which one is closer. I think they're both coming from below there. Yeah, I think so. I think both of them are coming. I swear using the stairs is so much faster, but this is just so much more fun. <laughs> Check it out, then you click stop and you go drop. There we go. We are going to... Actually, wait. No, I need to be on this floor. Wow, I just waited like a minute to just... <laughs> to get to this floor. Okay, this is going to be the magic room, you guys. Um, Let's see. It already has fireflies in the lamps. So I don't know in which lamp I'm going to put the firefly that I just caught. Uh, which room still needs fireflies? Oh, this one. This one could use a firefly. There you go. Urgh. There we go. I think this floor now has two firefly lamps like that in every room. So, yeah, I'm really enjoying the firefly lamps. Okay, make a magic workbench. And a... Oh, wait, I didn't learn it yet. Portal. Can you believe it? You can just make a portal. I didn't know. How did I not know this? How did I not know that you can just make a portal just like that? Oh, my God. You guys... What? This is crazy. Where am I going to even put this? What? I feel like it should either be like all the way to the side or completely in the middle. Uh, I think actually the workbench makes most sense to have. Oh, it's not that big. It's actually really small. Okay, Um. let's see. The magic workbench. I'm going to put this here. And the portal. I'm putting you here. What? Oh my god, okay, let's see if I can make this mole pickaxe. Pickaxe. I 
think it... Okay, 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 okay. Um, I think I'm going to check to try the mole pickaxe first to see if it actually works on the gems. And after that, I'm going into the portal. We're going to check it out. It's going to be so awesome. And then I really have to end up. So I've been recording once again for freaking 50 minutes. So it's going to be another hour long recording. I can't stop making these super long recordings. Tommy, why do you do this to yourself? Make shorter recordings. Oh, the elevator is going too fast for me. Right. I just got rid of my firefly because I'm not that smart. Okay, let's see if this works. What? It totally works! Check it out, you get magic stones from this. Magic stones, purple, thunder. Purple is thunder, green is wind, blue is water? Blue is water. What? And there was another one. I've seen another one. I don't want to fall because I'll die for sure. Okay, what is this? Earth. What? You get magic stones from this. I thought they were gems like in other games. No, they are magic stones that you use for like magic. And I haven't even really gotten into magic yet. Oh, I'm so excited. And if I would be a wise man, I would stop recording. And I would save this for the next episode. But I'm not going to do this. I'm going to try this right now. I'm going into the portal. I want to see the dinosaur museum. Wait. Oh, it drops items? Oh, 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 oh. I didn't know that. All right. Here goes nothing, you guys. Here goes nothing. Oh my god. What? What, you guys? This is insane. What? Oh man, like I've seen this place. I've seen this place in videos, in so many people's videos. And I was like, what is this place with the floating islands? I don't know what it is. But this is the dinosaur museum. Every time you kill something new that you haven't, haven't killed before, it says your dinosaur museum has been updated. And every time I was like, what does it mean? I don't know. It even has blocks. Check it out. Show information. I cannot read your information. Oh, wait. Water, mainly located in rivers and oceans. Unable to be dug through. May only be obtained by water intake so you don't have like a bucket in this game do you think there's a bucket grass block mainly located on the surface can be collected by bare hand or simple tools no it can't if you collect it you'll just get a normal dirt block oh this is so cool you learn about every single block <gasps> wait i want to learn about the block that purple block from before oh and iron and iron wait this is quartz no wait which one is iron um this one this one iron Located below the middle layer of the underground. A copper pickaxe or better is required to collect it. Okay, so this is the bedrock. The lowest layer beneath Pixark. Unable to be connected. So it has bedrock, just like in Minecraft. Please show me information on these blocks as well. I don't think it is. It's not showing me. I really want to know what this is. I think this is that purple block that I thought was a building. And then it said it's a sea block. And I wasn't near the sea. What is this? Oh my god, what is this? What? You guys, I really want to know what all of this is. I want to learn. I want to learn. Can I go for this? Please tell me I don't fall. Yes. Oh, this is so cool. So there's like a float. There's a, there's a floating island for every biome. That is so cool. So this is the grasslands biome. Where you have the huge sauropods and the tiny compies. Which, how did I not unlock it yet? I've killed compies. I guess maybe you have to tame it. No, wait. I don't have... I've never tamed a sauropod. So how do you get something in your animal museum? I don't actually know. Oh, a firefly. Ooh. What? It actually shows a lot of information like this. Except it's moving, which is hard to read. But does it show that for the sauropod? <gasps> the sauropod is the largest animal in Pixar. No, it isn't. We know that the largest animal in Pixar is actually the dodo. Ha ha ha. Uh, my dodo is the biggest one. Look at this. Look at this. Little dodo. I'm thinking about maybe on my dodo statue, I might put like a crown or a top hat on it. I'm not really sure. I might put a hat on it. That would be really funny. Okay, well, I don't have time to record all of these islands, to check out all of these islands in this video. Once again, I've been recording for super long. When will I learn? I don't know, but I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, even though it was a mess. I didn't even... Uh, I didn't even know what was going on. Uh, yeah, and apart from that, I hope you're having an awesome day. Don't forget to stomp like a dinosaur.